The Hopi tribe, nestled in the arid landscapes of the Four Corners region, stands as a testament to the resilience and cultural richness of Native American communities. This ancient tribe, with a history spanning millennia, has preserved its traditions, ceremonies, and distinct way of life against the backdrop of a rapidly changing world. This introductory section aims to provide a snapshot of the Hopi tribe, highlighting its cultural significance within the broader Native American context, and delineating the purpose of the documentary that seeks to unravel the layers of Hopi heritage. Through a lens that combines historical exploration, cultural immersion, and personal narratives, the documentary aims to transcend stereotypes and offer a nuanced portrayal of the Hopi tribe. By doing so, it endeavors to contribute to a broader dialogue on indigenous rights, cultural preservation, and the importance of honoring diverse perspectives in the ongoing narrative of North America's First Peoples. The origins of the Hopi people are shrouded in the mists of time, yet their migration stories, passed down through generations, provide a glimpse into their ancient past. According to Hopi oral tradition, their ancestors emerged into this world through a series of emergence points, guided by spiritual forces and following the sacred paths. The Hopi believe their destinies are intimately tied to the land, with each mesa and village holding a unique significance in their cosmology. Exploring the archaeological record, evidence suggests that the Hopi have occupied the region around the Four Corners area for thousands of years. The ancestral Puebloans, predecessors to the Hopi, left behind intricate cliff dwellings and petroglyphs, showcasing a complex and advanced society. The arrival of European explorers in the Americas marked a transformative period for the Hopi people. Spanish expeditions led by Coronado in the 16th century brought the first European contact to the Hopi villages. Initial interactions were characterized by curiosity and mutual exchange, but the subsequent colonization efforts led to significant disruptions in Hopi life. The imposition of Spanish rule and the introduction of European diseases had profound consequences for the Hopi. The integration of foreign practices into their traditional way of life and the encroachment on their lands initiated a period of adaptation and resistance, setting the stage for a complex relationship with European powers. Colonial influences intensified during the 19th century, with the establishment of the United States and its westward expansion. The Hopi, like many Native American tribes, experienced the encroachment of settlers, loss of territory, and cultural clashes. The signing of treaties and the forced assimilation policies further strained the delicate balance that the Hopi maintained with their environment and spiritual traditions. The imposition of boarding schools, where Native American children were forcibly separated from their families and cultures, left a lasting impact on Hopi communities. Despite these challenges, the Hopi persevered, holding steadfast to their cultural practices and fostering a sense of resilience that would characterize their identity in the face of adversity. The late 19th and early 20th centuries witnessed the establishment of reservations, including the Hopi Reservation in northeastern Arizona. While intended as a solution to protect Native American lands, Reservations often led to further challenges, including economic struggles, limited resources, and the imposition of external governance structures. In contemporary times, the Hopi face a complex array of challenges, including issues related to land rights, environmental conservation, and the preservation of cultural heritage. The clash between modern development and traditional values poses a unique set of challenges as the Hopi strive to maintain their identity while navigating the complexities of the 21st century. The heart of Hopi culture beats in rhythm with the mesas and plateaus of the Four Corners region, a landscape that encompasses portions of Arizona, New Mexico, Colorado, and Utah. The Hopi Reservation, established in 1882, serves as the focal point of their contemporary existence, but the roots of their connection to this land run much deeper. The mesas, including First Mesa, Second Mesa, and Third Mesa, each host distinct Hopi villages, each with its own history and cultural practices. These elevated plateaus not only offer a strategic defensive advantage but also hold deep spiritual significance for the Hopi. The Four Corners region, where the borders of their homelands intersect, 
symbolizes a convergence of spiritual energies and is integral to the Hopi cosmology. The Hopi people are intrinsically tied to the land, and their agricultural practices have sustained them for centuries. In a region where water is scarce, the Hopi have developed intricate methods of dry farming, relying on traditional farming techniques that maximize the use of limited water resources. Corn, beans, and squash, known as the Three Sisters, form the cornerstone of their agricultural practices. Beyond sustenance, the land provides materials for crafting tools, building homes, and creating art. The juniper and pine forests yield wood for construction, while clay from the earth is molded into the distinctive Hopi pottery. This harmonious relationship with the land is not just utilitarian but reflects a profound spiritual understanding of their role as stewards of the earth. For the Hopi, the natural world is imbued with spiritual significance, and their religious practices are deeply intertwined with the rhythms of nature. The changing seasons, the migration patterns of birds, and celestial events all play a role in their ceremonial calendar. The land itself is seen as a living entity, and the Hopi are entrusted with the responsibility of maintaining balance and harmony. The Katsunam, spiritual messengers, are central to Hopi cosmology. These supernatural beings are believed to visit the Hopi annually, bringing blessings, teachings, and ensuring the fertility of the land. The intricate dances and ceremonies performed by the Hopi are not mere rituals but acts of reverence, expressing gratitude to the natural world and seeking guidance from the spiritual realm. The fabric of Hopi society is woven with intricate kinship ties and a complex system of clans. The Hopi people are organized into matrilineal clans, with each clan tracing its lineage through the maternal line. The clans are not only social units but also spiritual entities, each associated with specific ceremonies and responsibilities. Clan membership is passed from mother to child, and individuals from the same clan are considered relatives. This kinship structure fosters a sense of communal identity and mutual support. The Hopi recognize a number of clans, each contributing to the cultural diversity within the tribe. The matrilineal emphasis reflects the importance placed on nurturing and continuity within the family and community. Hopi society exhibits a balanced division of labor and responsibilities between men and women. Both genders contribute significantly to the well-being of the community, and their roles are complementary. Men traditionally engage in agricultural activities, tending to the fields and participating in hunting when necessary. Women play a crucial role in the household, responsible for tasks such as cooking, childcare, and pottery making. While these roles are generalizations, the Hopi value the contributions of both men and women and recognize the importance of cooperation in maintaining a harmonious society. Spiritual responsibilities are also shared between genders. Certain ceremonies are specific to men or women, and both play essential roles in the religious life of the community. The Hopi embrace a holistic understanding of gender roles, recognizing the unique strengths and contributions of each gender within the broader context of communal harmony. Hopi society is structured around a system of social and ceremonial hierarchies, with individuals assuming specific roles and responsibilities based on their age and knowledge. The elders hold a revered position, as their wisdom and experience guide the community. Elders are often the keepers of traditional knowledge, passing down oral histories and cultural practices to younger generations. Ceremonial leaders, known as Kikmingwis, are central figures in Hopi religious life. These individuals are chosen for their spiritual knowledge and commitment to the community. Ceremonies, such as the Kachina dances, are organized by these leaders, and their guidance ensures the proper conduct of rituals. At the core of Hopi cultural identity lies a unique linguistic heritage. The Hopi language, part of the Uto Tekan language family, stands as a testament to the tribe's historical continuity and cultural distinctiveness. The Hopi language is a complex and rich system, reflecting the nuances of their worldview, social structure, and spiritual beliefs. Hopi is a polysynthetic language, meaning that words are often formed by combining several meaningful elements. The language is deeply integrated into daily life, 
used not only as a means of communication but also as a vessel for preserving traditional knowledge and expressing spiritual concepts. Efforts to maintain and revitalize the Hopi language are ongoing, as it is recognized as a vital link to the tribe's cultural heritage. The oral tradition holds a paramount place in Hopi culture, serving as the primary means through which history, values, and wisdom are transmitted from one generation to the next. In a society with a strong emphasis on communal identity, the spoken word becomes a powerful vehicle for the preservation of cultural continuity. Elders play a crucial role in the oral tradition, serving as the storytellers and keepers of traditional knowledge. Through the recounting of myths, legends, and historical narratives, the Hopi pass down not only facts but also the essence of their cultural identity. The oral tradition is dynamic, allowing for adaptation to changing circumstances while maintaining the core values that define the Hopi way of life. Storytelling occupies a central place in Hopi society, serving as a multifaceted tool for education, entertainment, and the reinforcement of cultural values. Narratives often feature Katsunam, the spiritual messengers, and other mythical beings, providing a framework for understanding the natural world, morality, and the interconnectedness of all living things. Through storytelling, the Hopi express their reverence for the land, their relationships with one another, and the significance of spiritual practices. These narratives are not merely historical accounts but living stories that evolve with each telling, adapting to the needs and challenges of the present while honoring the wisdom of the past. In addition to traditional stories, contemporary issues and challenges are also addressed through storytelling. This dynamic and adaptive approach to oral tradition ensures that the narratives remain relevant and resonate with each generation, fostering a sense of continuity and shared identity among the Hopi people. At the heart of Hopi culture lies a profound spiritual connection to the land, the cosmos, and the unseen forces that guide their lives. Hopi religious practices are deeply ingrained in daily life, shaping their worldview, ethical principles, and communal harmony. The religious ceremonies, often intricate and symbolic, play a pivotal role in maintaining balance within the community and in the natural world. Hopi religion is not a separate entity but is seamlessly integrated into every aspect of life. The spiritual practices are closely tied to the agricultural cycle, celestial events, and the changing seasons. The ceremonial calendar is a reflection of the Hopi's understanding of the interconnectedness between the earthly and the divine. Central to Hopi cosmology are the Katsunam, spiritual beings that serve as intermediaries between the Hopi people and the divine. These sacred spirits are believed to dwell in the San Francisco Peaks, a sacred mountain to the Hopi, and they visit the Hopi villages during specific times of the year. Katsunam are revered not only for their role as messengers but also as teachers, bringing blessings, agricultural knowledge, and guidance to the Hopi. The Katsunam are represented in elaborate wooden carvings, and their presence is celebrated through the famous Kachina dances. These dances are not merely performances but are considered sacred rituals that invite the Katsunam to share their wisdom with the community. The Katsina ceremonies are a complex and integral part of Hopi religious life. Each Katsina has a specific personality, role, and attributes, and their visitations are synchronized with the agricultural calendar, emphasizing the interconnectedness between spiritual practices and the sustenance of life. The Hopi ceremonial calendar is a carefully orchestrated series of rituals that mark the passage of time and ensure the well-being of the community. While the specifics of ceremonies may vary between villages, certain events are common to most Hopi communities. The Powamu ceremony, also known as the bean planting or bean dance, marks the beginning of the ceremonial year and focuses on the renewal of life. The snake dance, held in late August, is a renowned event where Hopi dancers handle live snakes to demonstrate their spiritual prowess and connection to the natural world. The Niman, or home dance, is a culmination of the ceremonial cycle, expressing gratitude for the harvest and seeking blessings for the coming year. These ceremonies are not only religious but also social and educational events. 
They reinforce communal bonds, pass down cultural knowledge, and express the Hopi's profound respect for the cycles of nature. The rituals serve as a living testament to the Hopi's commitment to maintaining balance, harmony, and spiritual connection in a rapidly changing world. Hopi pottery stands as a testament to the tribe's artistic prowess and cultural continuity. Rooted in ancient traditions, Hopi pottery is characterized by its distinctive style, intricate designs, and the use of natural materials. The art of pottery making has been passed down through generations, preserving not only the techniques but also the symbolism inherent in each piece. Hopi potters use clay extracted from the Hopi mesas, combining it with natural pigments to create a distinctive palette of red, black, and white. Traditional methods, such as coiling and pinching, are employed to shape the vessels, and the intricate designs are often inspired by Hopi cosmology, nature, and spiritual beliefs. The firing process, usually done outdoors using open fires, adds the final touch to these unique pieces. Hopi pottery is more than a craft. It is a form of storytelling. The designs often convey narratives related to creation, migration, and the interconnectedness of all things. Each piece carries with it the weight of tradition, a bridge between the past and the present, and a tangible expression of Hopi cultural identity. Symbolism plays a central role in Hopi art, transcending mere aesthetics to convey profound spiritual and cultural meanings. Whether expressed through pottery, textiles, or jewelry, symbols serve as a visual language, communicating the rich tapestry of Hopi cosmology and traditions. Common motifs include kiva steps, rain clouds, birds, and various geometric patterns. These symbols are not arbitrary. They carry layers of meaning and are often linked to Hopi mythology, daily life, and spiritual practices. The repetition of symbols across different art forms reinforces the interconnectedness of various aspects of Hopi culture. For example, the migration pattern of the Hopi is often depicted through a series of concentric circles, symbolizing both physical and spiritual journeys. The use of bird motifs may represent messengers or embody the spirits of Katsunam. Understanding the symbolism in Hopi art is to unravel the layers of meaning that contribute to the cultural richness and complexity of the tribe. Hopi art is not confined to museums or galleries. It is woven into the fabric of everyday life. Beyond its aesthetic appeal, Hopi art plays a crucial role in shaping and reinforcing cultural identity. The act of creating art becomes a form of cultural preservation, a way of transmitting knowledge, and a means of fostering a sense of belonging among the Hopi people. In the face of external pressures and cultural changes, Hopi art serves as a powerful tool for resilience. Through the creation and appreciation of art, the Hopi assert their unique identity, bridging the past with the present and influencing the trajectory of their cultural future. The impact of Hopi art extends beyond the tribal community, serving as a means of cultural exchange and education for those who engage with it. Contemporary Hopi society grapples with a myriad of challenges, some rooted in historical injustices and others emerging from the complexities of the modern world. These challenges underscore the delicate balance the Hopi must maintain between preserving their cultural heritage and adapting to the changing social, economic, and environmental landscape. One pressing issue is the preservation of ancestral lands. The Hopi have faced encroachments on their territory, impacting their ability to practice traditional land-based activities. Land disputes, resource extraction, and environmental degradation pose significant threats to the delicate ecosystems that sustain the Hopi way of life. Economic challenges, including high unemployment rates and limited access to education and health care, compound the difficulties faced by the Hopi. The reservation system, while intended to protect Native American lands, often results in economic disparities and limited opportunities for growth and development. Globalization and the influence of mainstream Western culture also present challenges to the preservation of Hopi traditions. The younger generation, exposed to external influences, faces the tension between embracing modernity and upholding cultural identity. In the face of these challenges, the Hopi people have exhibited remarkable resilience and determination to preserve their cultural heritage. 
Various initiatives and programs have been implemented to address the contemporary issues threatening the tribe's well-being. Cultural preservation efforts often involve educational programs within the Hopi community, emphasizing the importance of traditional knowledge, language, and customs. Initiatives to document and archive oral histories, ceremonies, and traditional practices contribute to the intergenerational transmission of cultural wisdom. Collaborations with external entities, such as academic institutions, museums, and governmental agencies, have facilitated the repatriation of sacred objects and artifacts, enabling the Hopi to reclaim and protect items of cultural significance. Efforts to address economic challenges include the promotion of sustainable development initiatives and the revitalization of traditional crafts, such as pottery making and basket weaving. These economic endeavors not only provide financial support to Hopi families but also contribute to the preservation of traditional skills and art forms. The Hopi's ability to navigate through centuries of challenges and change reflects a profound resilience deeply rooted in their cultural ethos. The concept of resilience extends beyond mere survival. It encompasses the adaptive capacity to thrive in the face of adversity while maintaining the core values of Hopi identity. Adaptation is a dynamic process for the Hopi. It involves a delicate dance between tradition and innovation. While the tribe embraces elements of modernity, such as education and technology, they do so in ways that align with their cultural values. The Hopi are adept at integrating new knowledge and practices into their existing framework, allowing them to meet contemporary challenges without compromising their identity. The resilience of the Hopi people is not only a testament to their strength as a community but also a source of inspiration for indigenous groups worldwide. It underscores the importance of preserving cultural diversity, fostering sustainable practices, and recognizing the resilience embedded in the traditions of Native American communities like the Hopi. In the modern world, education has become a crucial avenue for Hopi individuals to navigate the complexities of contemporary society while preserving their cultural identity. Efforts have been made to integrate traditional Hopi knowledge into formal education systems, ensuring that younger generations receive a well-rounded education that incorporates both Western and indigenous perspectives. However, educational opportunities on the reservation can be limited, leading some Hopi youth to pursue higher education off-reservation. This pursuit often involves a delicate balance between gaining valuable skills and knowledge in mainstream institutions and maintaining a strong connection to Hopi culture. Challenges such as high dropout rates, limited resources, and the need for culturally relevant curricula persist highlighting the ongoing struggle to provide quality education within the Hopi community. As a sovereign nation, the Hopi tribe engages in political processes and tribal governance to address internal and external challenges. The Hopi Tribal Council, comprised of elected representatives, plays a crucial role in decision-making and resource allocation within the community. Political engagement extends beyond the reservation, involving interactions with state and federal governments to advocate for Hopi interests. Challenges in political governance often mirror those faced by other indigenous nations, including issues related to land rights, natural resource management, and the protection of sacred sites. The Hopi people strive to balance the need for effective governance with the preservation of their unique cultural and spiritual heritage. The Hopi face the ongoing challenge of balancing the preservation of their rich cultural heritage with the demands and influences of the modern world. This delicate equilibrium requires navigating the complexities of globalization, technological advancements, and evolving societal norms. While embracing aspects of modernity, such as education, healthcare, and technology, the Hopi people are vigilant in ensuring that these advancements align with their cultural values. The integration of technology, for instance, is approached with a discerning eye, seeking to harness its benefits without compromising the core tenets of Hopi identity. In concluding our exploration of the Hopi people, their history, and their contemporary existence, one cannot help but be struck by their enduring resilience. The Hopi have weathered the storms of history, confronting challenges with a steadfast commitment to cultural preservation and adaptation. In celebrating the resilience of the Hopi people, 
We are invited to recognize the universal themes of human experience that resonate within their unique narrative. The Hopi stand as guardians of tradition, teachers of sustainability, and advocates for cultural diversity in a world that is constantly in flux. Their story is a call to appreciate the beauty of diversity, to honor the wisdom of indigenous cultures, and to embrace the enduring spirit of resilience that defines the Hopi people.